Please kindly notice that the UI has been renewed. Similar tools are grouped and after tape feature is added. Select button tool in 3D toolbar. Click on 2D pattern to create a button. Then there will be a button on the garment in 2D and 3D window. Hold down on button tool, then choose button hold tool in the sub menu. Click on the 2D pattern to create button hole. Also, you can create buttons along a pattern outline in a constant interval and distance. With button tool, right click on a pattern outline. Then, the pop-up window will be open. You can adjust the distance from the pattern outline. Or adjust the interval from pattern outline to the first button. Click reverse to reverse the direction. Then adjust the replicate interval and number of buttons. After clicking OK, the buttons are created. You can use the same way to create multiple buttonholes at the same time. Choose Select, Move Button Tool to Edit Button and Buttonhole. Click to select. Press Ctrl-C, then press Ctrl-V. There will be a preview button. Click to paste the button. Hold down on Shift key when paste to use guideline. Right-click to open Paste button window. Then you can input the interval and number of buttons. Right-click on the button, then you can choose to duplicate to Symmetric Pattern. Then, there will be buttons on Symmetric Pattern. Or you can choose to duplicate as buttonhole to symmetric pattern. It's useful to create buttons and buttonholes on Placket. Also, there is the same function in buttonhole right click pop up menu. You can choose to convert the buttonhole to button. Vice versa. Also, you can find the copy paste options in right click pop up menu. Please note that choosing mirror paste will only paste the position. If you want to move button, button hole, you can use Select Move Button Tool to drag them. Hold down Shift key to use Guideline. Right click when moving to adjust distance moved. You cannot move linked buttons. If you want to adjust them, please select Unlink in right click pop up menu. Select Fasten Button Tool. Click the button, then click the button hole to fasten them. When the button is fastened, there will be a lock icon near it. Click the button again to unfasten it. Also, you can fasten the button in 2D window. Click and drag in 2D window to use marquee box to select buttons and fasten them. After activating simulation, the button will be fastened.
Click Select Move Button Tool to select button and button holes. Right click on the button, then you can choose desired functions in pop up menu. Choose Reset 3D Position to reset the position of the button. When a button's location is adjusted, you can use this function to reset it. Then, there are the functions to create or duplicate. You can deactivate as desired. When the button is deactivated, the button will not be activated in 3D window. Choose Activate as desired. Also, you can use Select Move Tool to adjust the buttons. There are more options in Select Move Button Tool right click pop up menu. Choose Freeze to freeze buttons in 3D window. Unfreeze the froze buttons as desired. Sometimes there are layer garments between button and button hole. You can set number of sewing layers as desired. In the pop-up window, you can set number of sewing layers. Button goes through two layers. Choose Flip to flip the buttons to the other face of the pattern. When you select a button, you can edit its property in Property Editor. Change its angle to rotate it. Change thread length to make the button away from garments. You can select Style in the submenu. Toggle off collision to avoid collision between button and button hole. Click button hole to adjust its property. Change angle to rotate the button hole. Change bind rotation as desired. Then you can adjust style as desired. When you click a button style, you can adjust its property in Property Editor below. You can open and save the style as desired. Also, you can adjust the name of it. Then you can click to adjust the shape of button. Below, you can adjust thread type. You can choose cross parallel, or square, as desired. You can adjust width, as desired. Also, you can adjust thickness and weight, as desired. Then, you can adjust button, or thread's material, as desired. To learn more, you can check the fabric video. Select a buttonhole style to adjust its property. You can adjust its shape below. Also, 
you can adjust its width and material as desired. 